Hello, and welcome back to Fantasy Star 4, the end of the millennium. I'm Fuzzy J, and today we're going to finish off the fight with the Profound Darkness with the last two characters, first one being Demi. So, let's head out. Do that for good measure. Actually, let's uh, switch up this order a bit. Yeah, because they can both heal themselves, so... That should be for the best. And I'll meet you at the fight. Okay, and we're back at the first form of the profound darkness. So, barrier. I guess barrier. <laughs> So first form, basically will be saying, get your buffs up, deal out damage. Heal when necessary. Just want to see what her normal attack does. Huh, I actually can't cast that on her. The only person I ever normally cast this on is... Huh, I didn't realize it didn't affect androids. It never really came up, because I really only ever cast it on Chaz and her and Rika, because... For most of the fight, that's the only ones I needed boosted. <laughs> Rika has had to take on most of the healing responsibilities, which lowers my damage output a fair amount, but I get most of the back from Demi. Ouch. I'm also going to have to use... Uh, a bunch from Chaz for single targeting heals because I need TP from Rika for the uh, group healing. Alright, second form. Got time to 
do with this round, so that's good. It's only a little bit more than her normal attack. Wow. Okay. Um, that didn't actually hurt him very much. That's weird. Medical power. Um. Heal her up. Doesn't actually cure that much. Why was he able to one shot him? Now we start seeing where things start falling apart, apparently. from this thing that I haven't seen either I'm not sure ever or just in a very long time. I'm not sure if I mentioned this in earlier versions, but the way that transitioned was kind of weird, right? Like, Rune went last, but when it, after it dies, basically, it dies, and then it dies, whenever it dies in the round, it doesn't die until it would have gotten its turn, and then it transforms. Straight up run for can I out heal its terribleness? So much damage. Alright, um. Cover. Attack, attack. Use a star do. Yeah, that's... I got them almost to four. Close enough, anyway. I got rid of all of my trimates. Nope. Good. She'll do a little bit more damage than Demi can. Not by a lot, but a little bit. Get a Grand Cross in there. Nice. 
Good, she can heal herself next round. I'm not liking that. I'm not going first all the way through. 500 damage, nice. I think still went in that order? Wow. Alright, I guess it's just a lot faster than the other forms. <laughs> Double slash. Take it. Every round, one of the robots has to heal. Everybody else can attack. That's 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 a good day. Haha. <laughs> That ends up being basically a free round for me. But that's gonna hurt. Yep. Stardew with a top up for the other two people. That's what we'll do. I hope that's enough to keep everybody alive. Oh, just. Okay. Cover. Cover. Because based off this point, actually, we'll use an item. Two, three, four, five. So, oh, I still got lots. I'll be fine. Great random light explosions. Hey, how to cross cuts. That's okay. They really deal about the same damage as his base attack, but once again, Demi comes in for the victory. Our fifth uh, party member has been pulling their weight and defeating the Profound Darkness. We are victorious once again. So, um, give me one minute, and we'll meet back at the spaceport and pick up our last uh, our last attempt at this. Okay, and our final run through will probably be the most painful. I 
sure am. Alright. So, Graves, what do you have going on? Lacko Helm, Lacko Axe, and Lacko Mail. Good attack, not the best. Like, I think. Oh, actually, his attack power is technically higher than Chaz's by one point. Huh. And defense isn't quite as good, though. But, what can you do? Uh, it still just has Bruise, which isn't going to do us much good. Uh, sweeping is, like, Air Slash and uh, Disrupt. Not really going to be helpful, maybe in some of the lead-up battles, but Warcry to buff his own attack will be nice. Save a turn doing that. Heal up for good luck. Um, we're going to switch the order of this around a bit, too, because he has a lot of hit points. So we're going to put him... there we go. Okay, and I will meet you once again back at the Profound Darkness. Here we are, one final time. Hopefully I managed to make it through this one. <laughs> Alright, buff speed. Damn. Come on, barrier, where were you? Five seconds ago. Taking, but oh well. All right, one one down. Not too much trouble there. Been able to keep up with the healing, but this is where multi hit starts getting into the into play. So we're gonna throw another barrier up. And we're gonna start 
cross slashing. Or cross cutting and double slashing, whatever. Y'all knew what I meant. Okay. He's gonna recover. You're gonna use a Stardew. You're gonna start doing that, and that, and that. Okay. So I'm just apparently gonna do that twice in a row. Actually. That one wasn't even that bad. Yeah, that'll be good. I'm real annoyed by <laughs> by those. Uh, hopefully this will be the last round this thing's alive. But I have a feeling it's gonna be take longer because lots of healing sneak Wow. Okay. Uh you Should be all right. Yeah, that hurt. Cover. Stardew. And... Probably get away with that one. song is amazing. Oh, of course you do. I need to use the speed up, otherwise I get real thrown off to when its attacks are going to be. Thing going back up his barrier. It's 
probably need an attack off before barriers up. Nope, good. I do love the sound that axe makes though. Two solid rounds of full-on damage is very nice. Alright, he needs to be healed. It's brutal. I do like that you can learn it in the game, though. It's a really nice touch. Uh, you're gonna be using Stardew. You're gonna be topping off. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, put the robot to sleep. Good job, evil. Jeez. I lost count of where I was on a JHP, so I don't know how far along we are here. <laughs> soon, because he's out of useful techniques. Chaz is just about done on crosscuts, which is fine. That sucks. Just because you can... You use a soul dew, which I have lots of, and only ever needed one so far in any given fight, so that's good. Don't put him to sleep, I need him for damage. Good. Because Rune died, he no longer has barrier on him, so that's why I'm recasting that. Okay, and we are for the fifth time victorious. And that'll be the last time I defeat the Profound Darkness. Oh, I mean, on tape, I might go back and just beat it up a bunch because it's kind of satisfying to kill it, but, well, I'll leave you all here, 
I do hope you enjoyed the Let's Play. Um, if you want any of my other thoughts on kind of overall the game, you hop back a couple videos to when I first uh, did the uh, the final dungeon and beat the Profound Darkness, and uh, we can see the full ending and the credits there. So thank you all for watching, and uh, I hope you stick around for what I've got next. Have a great day.